Okay, Dungeon Channels. DC. So, as we're using Weeble and we discover more indicators, uh, I like to uh, go over these indicators and, um, you know, discover how they can be used to help us become better traders. So, as these Dunchian channels, DC, are three lines generated by moving average calculations that comprise an indicator formed by upper and lower bands around a mid-range or medium band, median band, the upper band marks the highest price of a security over N periods, while the lower bands mark the lowest price of a security over N periods. N periods refers to the length you set above in the input section. Now this would be 20. Um, we can adjust this and we can see in the background, or let's move this over, as we adjust it, the bands change and get bigger and they give you more or less buying signals depending on you know how we have it set, but let's set it to default for now. Um, I sometimes like to set things under default. It depends on how the stock is trading uh, to my liking. But, you know, for these, uh, basically what it's saying is that it's going to draw boxes around, um, the, you know, the entire band here. And what we can consider is that price action is going to happen 50% above or below the line. So if it's trading above the line, we know that... Uh, price action is high or moving upwards. Uh, that's a good thing. So what we want to do in this situation is try to catch this dip under and wait until we see the reversal that breaks back above the line, which would be these dojis. You could buy here or buy here. Uh, it depends on how aggressive your style is. Now, if you wanted to continue using just this, I like using other indicators, but uh, you, you would study this chart um, or any chart that you have this applied to. And you would wait until you would see the dip below and then the break back above to buy, or you may even buy the lower dip. Um, as long as it doesn't break outside of this box, you know that you are within a safe range. So if you're low here, you'll look and wait until it confirms high. Uh, here's some indecision and you're engulfing candle, so uh, you, know, you might consider buying there. Um, and then you might swing it until this next high. Um, or you may even buy right here on this candle and you would ride it all the way up and you would sell out up top because when you've done your candle studies, you would know that looking at candles like this um, would tell you that uh, there's some indecision and some selling off and things like that. Um, and then you can look through the volume as well. I, I like looking at volume. Um, I'm a big volume trader. so. But these are the Dunshian channels. Um, I hope I'm saying that correctly. And uh, we're using them on the Weeble platform. So uh, as I go through, I like seeing uh, you know, what different indicators there are and what we can learn about them and what they can teach us. Um, it, it, it gets me very excited to see a um, chart that can be read and determined accurately uh, through different indicators. So that's why I'm covering this one. It seems like it could be helpful for your arsenal of indicators. And if you find that real special set of indicators that you like, you can save your indicator set. So you can always have it with you. You know, um, let's just say we were using that one. Um, but, you know, we're going to cover just DC for now. And short and sweet, you know, there it is. Uh, Take it, study it, you know, use it, don't use it, you know, um, but I, I, I think it's great, you know, it uh, reminds me of a Bollinger Band, and actually it, you know, seems almost just a little bit more helpful. So, make the decision yourself, uh, play with it, look at it, you know, have a good time, you know, and happy trading.